I S U P K. Shalom, shalom. This is Callum L from London, UK, all the way to the US of A. Listen, subscribe to ISUPK. I'm always on that channel checking out the new knowledge that ISUPK is dropping.
our days are fulfilled. For our end is come. For our walk, our end is come. Walk. Our end is come. Mark Dawkins' end came on that street. He got shot to death and left to bleed out on that street. And they still handcuffed him, still was turning him air, asking him where's the gun, even though they knew he didn't have no gun on him. Give me Zechariah chapter 11 and verse 5. I'm going to show you, our possessors have always been slaying us and they haven't stopped. This has been written in the book of Zechariah thousands of years ago and it's still happening today to black men. Let me know when you get there. What Zechariah uh, Rick, Rick, thousands of years ago is still happening to black men in 2016 and it's still going to be happening in 2017 if you don't separate and if you don't uh, come and serve the Lord. Give me Zechariah chapter 11 and verse 5. Zechariah 11. Verse 5. Whose possessors slay them? Who's what? Whose possessors slay them? Who's what? Whose possessors slay them? Whose possessors slay them? Guess what? Mark Douglas' possessors slayed him. Jermaine Baker's possessors slayed him. That's right. Our possessors have been slaying us and they don't stop slaying us. Read. Whose possessors slay them and hold themselves not guilty. Hold on, they do what? Hold themselves not guilty. Guilty. No, no, it was a law for killing to do what? Hold themselves not guilty. The Bible says whose possessors slay them and hold themselves not guilty. No, they killed Mark Duggan and hold themselves not guilty. You seen the policeman there on the documentary smiling, saying we had to shoot him or he would have shot us and they didn't find no gun on him. Which they, 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 they lied about Mark Duggan. Read that again from the top. Whose possessors slay them and hold themselves not guilty. Give me uh, Psalm 64 verse 3. It says, whose possessors slay them and hold themselves not guilty. Black men get murdered and nobody gets found guilty. They walk free from court. And uh, they walk free from court when black men get murdered. You know why? Because they're our possessors who slay us and hold themselves not guilty. Give me Psalm 64 verse 3. Psalm 64 and 3. Who wet their tongue like a sword and bend their bows to shoot their arrows. To do what? Bend their bows to shoot their arrows. And they wet their tongue like a sword about Mark Duggan. They said he was a criminal. They said he was one of the um, most 45 deadliest criminals in Europe. They said he deserved to get shot because he had a criminal record. And on his criminal record, all he had on there was handling stolen goods. That don't make him the worstest criminal in, in Europe. They lied on Mark Duggan. Read that again from the top. Who wet their tongue like a... And they wet their tongues and use that as an excuse to murder a black man. They use everything as an excuse to murder a black man. Read. Who wet their tongue like a sword and bend their bows to shoot their arrows. Even bitter words. Even what? Bitter words. Even what? Bitter words. Mark Duggan was a criminal to say what? Bitter words. Oh, yeah, um, he had a gun to say what? Bitter words. Oh, um, Mark Duggan, uh, he went going nowhere in his life, what? Bitter words. And they used bitter words so they could execute him in the street. They executed Mark Duggan in the street and they showed them the documentary. Read on. Verse 7. But God shall shoot at them. Verse 4. Psalm 64 and 4. They may shoot in secret at the perfect. Suddenly do they shoot at him. Hold on, suddenly did they do what to Mark Duggan? Shoot at him. As soon as they pulled Mark Duggan's text, what did they do? Shoot at him. Before they could even uh, tell him to put his hands on, what did they do? Shoot at him. That's Before right. they could even um, tell him to stop, what did they do? Shoot at him. And they shot at Mark Duggan suddenly. Read that again from the top. They may shoot in secret. At the and, and guess what? They thought they'd done this in secret. They tried to lie. They said they had a gun, but they didn't find no gun. Read. At the perfect. Suddenly, at, at, the what? at the perfect. And on the documentary, they said we pulled his car at the perfect time on the quiet road. Suddenly, do they shoot at him and fear not? And, and what? And fear not. And fear not. And what? And fear not. And they shot Mark Duggan and feared not. They shot Mark Duggan and feared not. And guess what else did? They lied on him. They said that he had a gun and shot a police officer. They said he shot a police officer. And then when they checked, their own police officer shot the police officer. How dare they say Mark Duggan had a gun and he had no gun on him. They found the gun the next day and he had none of his DNA on there. They lied on the black man. They may shoot in secret. At the they what? Shoot in secret. They thought they shot that brother in secret. But guess what happened? Black people saw it and went wild and rioted, burned down all the stores. 
even though that's the wrong way to go about it. But guess what, black man? We feel you pain, you know why? Because we black like you. Right. I'm a black man like Mark Doggan. Right. I've got kids like Mark Doggan. I've got a mother and father like Mark, Do Mark Doggan. I live in the ghetto like Mark Doggan. Right. So I know what he went through. That's they right. shoot black men 24 7. That's black right. men, you should care about Mark Doggan, you know why? Because you could be Mark Doggan tomorrow. That's right. You could be Mark Doggan next week. You know why? Because our oppressors slay us and hold themselves not guilty. Read that again from the top. That they may shoot in secret. And they shoot us. They think it's a secret. Guess what? It ain't no secret. There's cameras rolling. Guess what? They still hold themselves not guilty. Even those caught on film. Even those caught on film, they hold themselves not guilty. You know why? Because Mark Doggan, uh, he's just a slave to them. He's just a nuisance. He's just a black man to them. And nobody cares about black people's lives. So when we die, no one cares. They hold themselves not guilty. Read. Suddenly, do they shoot at him? Suddenly what? Do they shoot at him? Suddenly what? Shoot at him. And they done that to Mark Doggan. They pulled that taxi. Before he could even get out properly, suddenly do they shoot at him. Before he could even get out of the taxi and put his hands up, they fired shots into Mark Doggan's chest. That's right. Three. And fear not. And what? And fear not. And what? And fear not. And they don't fear not. That's why they was in the documentary smiling. What was his name? Um, something W. What, 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 did, what did he go by? Remember a certain name? Yeah, W. One or whatever he calls himself. He feared not. He was on the TV smiling. He was on the TV saying, I would shoot him again if I had the opportunity. Which lets you know soon that same officer is going to go out and shoot a black man. Which lets you know he can't wait to kill another black man. Read. They encourage themselves in an evil matter. They what? Encourage themselves in an evil matter. They, they encourage themselves in an the evil matter. They encourage themselves. They uh, Before they shot him, they sat down and said he's a deadly criminal. Don't, uh, don't, don't, um, don't play with this one. This one's dangerous. This one's deadly. They encouraged themselves with evil words so they could go out and shoot a black man. They had their finger on the trigger before he came out of the taxi. Good. Read. They commune of lying. Hold on, they what? They commune of lying snares. They what? Commune of lying snares. The Bible says they commune of lying snares. Read that again. They commune of lying snares. Oh no, um, the plant is the gun what? Lane snares. They do what? Lane snares. And they laid the snare against Mark Doggan. They planted that gun on the scene. They said that was his gun, even though um, no, no officer saw him throw the gun. Now, if a man throws a gun, you're going to see it. How can you not see a man throw a gun? They, no officer said that they seen him throw a gun, but they found the gun uh, in the grass. They said it was his gun. They done forensics on that gun. He had none of his gear down there. That's which right. Means it wasn't Mark Doggan's That's gun. That's right. Read that again. They encourage themselves in an evil matter. They commune of laying snares privily. They, they what? Laying snares privily. They laid that gun what? Privily. They laid that gun what? Privily. They laid that gun what? Privily. And they laid that gun privily. They put that gun there privately later on and said, oh, there was 11 officers, but not one of them found the gun. But I was later to found the gun. They laid that gun what? Privily. And they laid that gun there after everybody was gone so they could try and frame the brother. Right. But guess what happened? No DNA came back on that gun. So those officers should be charged for the murder of Mark Doggan. Because right. that was murder. That was a broad daylight execution of a black man. Right. Read that again from the top. They encouraged themselves in an evil matter. And they encouraged themselves in an evil matter. They sat down there when they, was, um, when they decided, all right, we're going to stop him today. They encourage other officers, all right, this one's deadly. He's a criminal. He's one of the most deadliest criminals in Europe. How's the man, man one of the most deadliest criminals in Europe, if all he had in his record was um, handling stolen goods? How does that make him a deadly criminal? How does that make him a deadly criminal? You know why they said he was a deadly criminal? Because he's a black man. That's they right. Say every black man like a deadly criminal. Right. Whether your record's clean, whether you're rich, whether you're poor, they see you as a deadly criminal. Read that again from the top. They encourage themselves. In an evil matter, they commune of laying snares. And they laid snares when they put that gun there. Everybody knows they dumped that gun there. They said Mark Doggan um, picked up a gun from an other brother. But guess what? They didn't, they, uh, they didn't find none of his DNA on it. Which means it wasn't his gun. Read. Laying snares privily. Do you what? Laying snares privily. Laying snares privily, that's what they done. They say, who shall see them? They say what? Who shall see them? They say what? Who shall see them? And they murder black men and say who shall see them. But guess what black men? 
the ICPK, our eyes are open. We seen that they planted that damn gun. We seen that it was an unlawful killing. And they say, who shall see us? Well, the whole world seen that that was a murder and that that was an execution. Read on. Verse six, they search out iniquity. They accomplish a diligent search. They, they what? Accomplish a diligent search. Both the inward thought and every one of them. And the heart is deep. It says inward and every one of them. They fought in their mind. They knew they was going to shoot him that day. They knew they were in a black man dead that day. And this is why they took a while to give him CPR. They seen that he was on the floor and they still uh, putting handcuffs on him. He's got handcuffs on him and he's bleeding to death. That's how black men die in the United Kingdom. That's how black men die in America. That's how black men die everywhere we are, all over the world. Read on. Verse seven, but God shall shoot at them. Hold on, but what? But God shall shoot at them. But black men, if you decided to come and serve the Lord, if you decided to come and serve the Lord, they couldn't kill us the way they do. You know why? Because we would have God on our side. And black men, it's about time we have God on our side. That's so we right. don't die the death like Mark Duggan died. So we don't die the death like Jermaine Baker died. We need God on our side. Because if not, we're going to keep dying in the streets, just like Mark Duggan did. Verse 7. But God shall shoot at them with an arrow. Suddenly shall they be wounded. Suddenly what? Shall they be wounded. Black men, if you serve Christ, when Christ returns, we're going to be here when Christ starts to wound our oppressors and all of our enemies. Give me Psalm chapter 58 and verse 2. Black men, come and serve the Lord if you only live to see that day. Because the only days we see is black people dying, black people oppressed, black people in slavery. Give me Psalm chapter 58 and verse 2. Psalm 58 and 2. Yea, in heart we work wickedness. Ye wait the violence of your hands. And that's what they've done. They work wickedness against black men. They work wickedness against Mark Duggan. And they violently shot him to death. Read that again from the top. Yea, in heart ye work wickedness. And in their mind, they think wickedness. In their mind, they think all black men are criminals. They think a black man's life ain't nothing. They think because a man's black, that gives them to go ahead to murder him. Because they know that nobody's going to care. They know black people only uh, march for two, three days. Then after two, three days, uh, they go back to celebrating Christmas. Go back to celebrating Easter. Go back to living normal. So they know they can murder us and get away with it. Read that again. Ye, in heart. Ye work wickedness. They work wickedness in their mind, man. Read. Ye weigh the violence in of your hands. They what? Weigh the violence in your hands. They what? Weigh the violence of your hands. And it was violent for them to have the MP5 and shoot Mark Duggan with it. That was violence, that was. That was, a, they murdered him execution style. Read that again. Ye, in your heart, work wickedness. Ye weigh the violence of your hand in the earth. And you weigh the violence with your hands in the earth. They shed our blood in the earth. They murder us in the earth. They kill us in the earth. They throw us in prison in the earth. And thank, uh, thank you for that. Ye, ye, in your heart, ye wear wickedness. Ye weigh the violence of your hands in the earth. They weigh the violence of their hands in the earth. They do violence in the earth. They murder us. They said Mark Duggan shot the officer. But when they... Uh, what they realized later on, they realized their own officer shot the officer. They even want to blame a black man without a gun for shooting someone. Right. How the hell did he shoot an officer and he ain't got no damn gun? They shot them damn self, but they want to put the blame on a black man. That's black right. men get the blame for everything that takes place in the earth. That's right. Whether they do it or whether they don't do it. You know why? Because they treat black men like garbage. They belittle black men. And Mark Duggan had no damn gun that day. And I'm, I'm not going to stop saying it. They, uh, them officers deserve to uh, be put on trial. They deserve to be thrown in jail for the murder of my brother, a black man by the name of Mark Duggan. And black man, he's your brother too. My whole life was trying to find something to follow. Hand Lord to every man tried to borrow. Felt pain. And a lot of sorrow got betrayed, so packed I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm and blues Call this guitar smoke 
rebel with no cause, trying to find direction. The world got me vexed. Picked up a bad lick of habit that's hereditary from oppression. Felt like my life was on fire, trying to find an exit. Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck. Sometimes a follower is a soldier, trying to find a good ship. Plus, when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom the breath of life, I'm believing fairy tale. Listen well to what I tell. No call it can cause pain. Something that a rebel knows very well. Can't you tell I was sent from the Lord? Got a tongue like a two-edged sword. 